Hmm, now that's strange. I feel butterflies in my stomach, but I don't remember having any butterflies for lunch. <laughs> anyway, here's my TED talk on gelatology, which actually isn't the science of gelatin, even though jello would be a delicious topic. It's actually the science of laughter, our product trusted by a majority of the population to be the best medicine out there. Here it goes. Okay, so a doctor was walking down a hallway at the hospital when a nurse rushes up. She exclaims, doctor, there's a patient on the line and he says he's invisible. The doctor replies, tell him I can't see him today. <laughs> Did that make you laugh? I hope so, because according to the real doctors at the Heart Foundation, laughing does wonders for your health, including increasing your blood flow, strengthening your immune system, and reducing your stress. It also technically counts as cardio. That's right, lazy people. Just laugh all day and your heart will start pumping while your calories start burning. Sorry, did I say lazy? I meant indolent. That's the medical term, but it also works as an excuse for staying inside and eating burritos. Did you know that laughter even has lasting mental benefits? The Help Guide organization, which is a mental help organization, says that laughing gives you a more positive outlook on life, especially through difficult situations. As a bonus, it gives you a great feeling inside at no extra cost. And you can enjoy these benefits for much longer than the leading brand due to a longer lifespan caused by daily laughter. Our brand has been trusted since 1900 BC, which was when the first joke was told according to Reuters. Comedy clubs were really boring before then, let me tell you. <laughs> But laughter isn't just for you. Spread the love, as they say. Laughing is better together. To clarify, you shouldn't laugh at people, but with people. The Help Guide organization also states that you're more likely to laugh when you're around others. It also strengthens your connection to family and friends and, as you probably know, is very contagious. However, nine out of 10 doctors actually recommend spreading this disease. But wait, you may say, there's a pandemic out there, and the only social interaction I've had in the past year has been over Zoom. And to that, I say, give up being a social vegan and go meet some new friends. <laughs> anyway, back to my point. Laughter can be shared even without being in the same room. An informal study done by Leadership Freak shows that even laughing in a Zoom can cause others in the call to laugh with you, and causes the benefits stated previously. Thanks to you, they just got in their daily cardio. Many people call laughter a universal language. That's what I call Google Translate. But seriously, everyone around the globe can laugh. It unites everyone regardless of culture, gender, race, ethnicity, social class, religion, age, and even political party, which <laughs> is not easy to do. Here's a picture from the Wikipedia entry for joke showing the then president of Russia, Boris Yeltsin, enjoying a joke with former US president, Bill Clinton. As you can see, humor can bring entire countries together. So how do you get this life-changing product? It's easy. Just find something humorous about your everyday life. In the words of Nobel Prize winner, Nils Bohr, some things are so serious they can only be joked about. Also, shipping and handling costs may apply. Ask your doctor about laughter today.